So Tyson Fury did an interview on Behind the Gloves with Michelle Joy Phelps and he's talking about how he felt no one is able to beat Deontay Wilder apart from him. It's quite strange because Fury out of his own mouth has said once that Wilder felt like he was cherry picking him but Fury was actually the one doing the cherry picking. That because Fury had an offer to fight AJ but he turned that down and went on went ahead to fight Wilder. So that in itself shows that he felt AJ was a stronger champion out of AJ and Wilder. So he can't he can't actually turn around and say he doesn't feel AJ is capable of being Wilder. It's, it's just strange. But anyways, that's quite similar to the type of stuff Deontay Wilder says about Luis Ortiz. So basically Deontay Wilder is to Tyson Fury what Luis Ortiz is to Deontay Wilder because if you look at Luis Ortiz's career he has the same handlers as Deontay Wilder they don't want to put him in with any live body whatsoever so we can just you know make Luis Ortiz be this mythical creature and just gonna have um, Deontay Wilder as the two solitary losses on his CV forever so we're never gonna find out how good this guy was he's just gonna be this great amazing cuban that only deontay wilder managed to beat so fury is quite smart in the sense that he's actually managed to find the exact same thing in deontay wilder because he knows for a fact deontay wilder is quite similar to ortiz in the sense that they don't have the same handlers but he knows wilder is not gonna fight no one just like ortiz isn't gonna fight anybody so he's got that wild on his, on his um, those two wild, two wilder wins. Let's face it, he's got two wilder wins on his CV. Well, a draw and a win. He's got those on his CV, and he knows for a fact wild is not going to test himself. So he's just going to be this mythical, mythical um, m- phantom puncher, this um, world class puncher that no one people were apparently scared of. Yeah, right. So he's just gonna have that in his CV and talk up Wilder forever and ever and ever. Just like Wilder does with Ortiz. Although I fight back to back killers, Ortiz is a back to back killer. <laughs> you know, even though Ortiz refuses to fight anybody, he got offered the Dylan White fight, refused to fight Dylan White. He went struggled with my um with Christian Hammer fighting random what was the other guy for um Travis Kaufman and all sorts of crap. Are you a proper contender or what are you? Are you going to fight? Are you going to mingle it with the big boys? Or are you just strictly here for Deontay Wilder? To serve Deontay Wilder? It's just ridiculous. So Fury, he's, he's found himself... Uh, it's, uh, Deontay Wilder is basically Tyson Fury's Luis Ortiz. Listening to the interview, Fury, just like everyone else, like you and me, he feels um, Wilder is not all there mentally. So we all feel he probably he's probably not going to return to the ring just like Fury so he's probably praying for that as well so he's probably gonna be happy if Wilder retires doesn't fight the well, just, you know, just disappeared so he can keep talking about this this mysterious guy that he managed to knock out this this scary puncher guy that everyone was scared of that um Dylan White was running away from where you at Wilder let's go let's go let's go I'm ready just you know change the narrative like he always does and just boost up his cv without trying to do the hard work please out of curiosity or and just for you know conversation's sake when is ortiz next fight who is he fighting next is he retired is he active inactive what's going on that's the point exactly the guy is not a proper contender he's just there for the underwater purposes only and to collect a check so whenever they give him a run out against one of these no hopers he'll probably just go out collect his check and that's it until it's time to call it a day he's not here to try and you know you know try and fight aj or fury or nothing like that it's that's not what this is that was just some decoration for wilder cv so yeah just like wilder is for fury cv now yeah that's that's how that's gonna turn out for wilder unfortunately as usual thoughts in the comment section below like the videos subscribe if you're new here let us know how old ortiz is as well hit the notification bell and i'm out